Hi friends, welcome back to Lessons with Krista and Isabella. Isabella. So well, today we have some holiday activities we're going to show you. And yeah. A cane. Yeah. She's holding. Isabella is holding up a candy cane. Why are we holding up a candy cane today, Isabella? Do you remember why? Yeah, I know. Why? Because we're gonna do this. Yeah. So what Isabella is doing is she's pretending like she's bingo dabbing the paper. Okay? So we know that some families and friends um, don't have printers at home. So um, usually we try to do some kind of a bingo dabber activity. Well, if you don't have that, guess what? You can make one on your own with white paper. Yeah. And this particular one, we don't have the dots because we have these spaces here. Okay? We're going to play a game today with it. So what we're going to do is we've got these dice from Dollar Tree and we wrote numbers one, two, three, and four, four on them, okay? Mm-hmm. Then we also have another one from Dollar Tree and we have colors on them. So we wrote red, mm-hmm. orange, mm-hmm. purple, mm-hmm. and green because those are the color markers we could find. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to roll the dice mm-hmm. to get a number. Then we're going to roll this dice to get a color. And whatever number we get, that's how many spaces we're going to fill in on this candy cane. Okay, and then we're going to fill it in with the color too. Alright, so Isabella. Gentle. Whoa, okay, so we got number one. Alright, I'm going to roll this one. Color. Oh, and we got green, so we're going to color in our candy cane with one green spot, okay? You can be anywhere, so one green, anywhere. Go ahead, Isabella, color your green, I'm gonna color mine green. There we go. Green, 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 one spot green. Okay, okay. hey! We colored the same spot, so there you go. There's the example, one green. You wanna hold your up, Isabella? Show your green. Awesome. I did it so. Okay, now let's roll the dice again. Roll it gentle, okay? Nice and gentle. Oh, a little more force. (laughs) There we go. Let's try again. Okay, this time we got number two. 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 Okay, you want to roll this one? The color? Yeah. Ooh, we got purple this time. So now we have to color two spots purple. All right, let's see. I'm gonna color mine right in here. Purple, and purple now. All right. All righty, and so there's two spots purple. Ooh, Isabella, you got two spots purple too. All right, here, go again. Here, I'm gonna roll it this time with the number. Whoa, we didn't get anything. <laughs> oh my goodness, again. This is a hard one. Ooh, we got four this time. So four, that's the number we're gonna call, or that's the number. What's the color? The color? Ooh, it's gonna be red. red. We got four spots red now, I get okay? Red. All right. And it's good to count them as you color them. So I have one, two, three, and then four. That way you're coloring and you're counting at the same time. So there's hey, my four. Red, Mama. Mm-hmm. 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 That's good. Oh, is it kind of a pinkish red? That's okay. That's okay. You can use that red. Okay. So then that's what you would do. You would keep doing that all the way until you fill in your candy cane, okay? All right, so that's one example. Mm-hmm. The other example Isabella has been patiently waiting for. Are you ready, Isabella? Mm-hmm. All right, let me grab those other pieces here. All right, now, friends, we made the same thing, but this time we laminated them, okay? Mm-hmm. We laminated them. So that way we can use them with some Play-Doh! Yay! Yes, that's why Isabella is so, so excited. Okay, so Isabella, go ahead. Use your mat to put some Play-Doh on there. Okay? okay? We also made one with a wreath. Mm-hmm. And, oh, let me just show them really quick. 
on here we labeled them candy cane um, so that way your child can see the print that's a good idea to do that they see the actual object and they see the print and then they use their fine motor skills with the yeah, play -Doh. so i think blue okay are you gonna put uh, balls on there or are you gonna put stripes i'm gonna put balls on there. Put balls on there. okay and then so we did another one for a wreath again this is trying to make it look like the um, bingo dabber pages. Um, our printer wasn't working at this time, so that's why we did it this way. And if you don't have a printer, it's easy to make your own just like this, okay? And then one more. I know it kind of looks like a rocket ship from here. <laughs> it's a candle, okay? It looks like a rocket ship because I put the little dots on there, but it's, a, it's supposed to be a candle, okay? And it says happy holidays on there. Okay, so those are just a few uh, holiday activities that we have. Okay, and let me get the camera a little closer so you guys can see Isabella is putting some Play-Doh on her candy cane. Yeah. Yeah, isn't that so fun? It's all colored in. It's all colored in? You're going to put Play-Doh all over, right? Yeah. Okay. All right, friends, so that is our couple of holiday activities. We have more that we're going to be share, sharing with you um, in the next couple weeks. But for today, that's all. So we thank you for watching our videos. And if you like this video, please go ahead and subscribe and share the video so more people can see to, our videos. If you have this video, you can have this. Don't forget to subscribe. <laughs> that's right. All right, friends, we hope you have a wonderful day. And we'll Bye. see you in the next video. Bye-bye.